All right, guys, so I have a marketplace order from Calls Box. No, this is not the spring box. I actually just got the marketplace order from the spring box. This is from my winter box. I switched it over from the cardboard box to a bag. Um, it did come very delayed, but I am filming it later. I've probably had this for about a month, uh, but then all the FabFitFun spoilers came out, and I just had, and then my edits, and then the edit sale, and I just had too much going on. So... I figured I would show you now because a lot of the stuff I got is stuff that shows up over and over again. Um, I do get a lot of like everyday stuff from cause box sales, even like cleaning stuff. So that's the first thing I'm going to show you right now. Even if you guys check my other like add-on box sale, I grabbed these. These are from Full Circle. You get a pack of two. I literally think they are $2 or $2.50 in the sale. Um, these are a little fancy than regular sponges because they are a walnut scrubber sponge. So it's scrubbing power from plant-based materials. It says it's absorbent, abrasive, clean dishes, countertops, appliances, and more. It says it's a sustainable choice. So that's why, you know, you can't get like, you know, an eight pack of sponges for like $2 or a dollar even at Dollar Tree, but it's responsible living. It's earth healthy materials. It's safe for you, non toxic. These are even dishwasher safe, or you can throw them in the microwave to disinfect. So I really enjoyed these. So I grabbed two of these. And then, you guys can see this one missing because I have had this a little bit. Um, I grabbed this as well. It's a full circle. This was a pack of three, and this is a scrubber sponge. So it has, it says two sides for easy cleaning. Same thing. It's made of recycled plastic and celios. So this one's a little bit different, but I thought that was so cool. It literally said, I remember when I went to go purchase how many like plastic bottles it used to create it. So I loved the concept and you get the regular white sponge on the other one side, but you get like the scrubby side on, with this blue. And same thing, dur it's durable, dishwasher safe, safe for you, non-toxic, earth-friendly materials, responsible living, sustainable choice. I just thought it was really cool that it was made from recycled plastics. Um, yeah, it says... The abrasive is made from the recycled water bottles and the plant-based celios. That's so cool. Um, and again, these can also be put in the microwave to disinfect. So I have one right now in my sink I've been enjoying. And then I grabbed a few of these cloths. So this is kind of supposed to replace like paper towels because you can just keep like reusing these. They are stiff right now. I haven't used them yet. But when you wet them, they soften up and they're supposed to just like pick up spills. Um, I honestly, these were literally only a few dollars. So I just grabbed one of each they had one with like a cute little x print one with like a checkered print and then they had one that was like a few bucks more that was like double the size so i picked those up um i do have like just um rags that i use all the time i don't know if rags is the right word just like dish cloths uh because i am trying to use less paper towel i do still use paper towel here and there uh but definitely not as much as i used to and then I also grabbed these reusable sandwich bags. Again, just trying to be better for the environment. Instead of one-time use items, you literally can hand wash these with soapy water and you're all set. You have it again uh, to keep reusing. So this ends up being way cheaper in the long run. And again, it's a full circle item. Comes with two. I think this was like maybe five bucks. So again, it's the safe for you, non-toxic, earth-friendly materials, intentional design. These are BPA-free storage bags, leak-proof, airtight, lock-seal design. It still has flat for easy packing and storage. Um, you know, you can do your fruits, your vegetables, even like I've seen people use this even like for craft storage. Um, if you want to think of it a little bit outside the box but you can oh whew, even like my sandwiches for work like whatever you can use those for a lot of different things and then more kind of reusable items i grabbed these shrinking straws i think these might have came in a bundle because sometimes they do do bundle these because i have plenty of straws i don't think i would have just ordered this but i'm okay with having a few more that's all right um i am supposed to be moving to a bigger place soon i hope i don't know i'm supposed to be looking at a place soon that has really good potential i've been mentioning in my whole time been like trying to find a bigger place to live so maybe i can finally have people over this place is so small and has so many stairs my mom has never come to my apartment which really makes me sad uh because she can't uh, she can't do all the stairs i have four Four flights of stairs where I live it's crazy I die every day but anyway so good more straws is always good and I love that these are rose gold and it comes with the cleaning brush um I mean I think you guys know what straws are you know but I will show it it's just the straight ones because I do have some that have like the curve to them it says they're eight milliliters which is I guess what the opening is the mouth opening so that is it right there 
um hmm, i feel like the ones i have are smaller so that's actually might come in handy this might be good for when i do like smoothies and stuff because it looks like it has a bigger mouth opening so i grabbed that bpa free phthalate free eco-friendly reusable recyclable easy to clean sleek design cleaning up as a breeze brush included okay I also grabbed this from Be Kind. I like that it comes in like this cute little bag. And it is more stuff to wash my dishes. So I will show you guys. It comes with the brush that has the handle. And then you can literally take it off just by pulling on this metal latch here. And it comes with the replaceable head. And then it comes with this one. It's a handheld brush. So you don't need like a handle handle. And I currently use one of these right now to wash my dishes. I switch back and forth between this and the sponge. So I'm going to throw that one away and use this one to replace it. Because that one is, that was from like two sales ago. So I've had that one maybe like six months now. So it even says how they're natural bristles. And it's FCA certified wood. And it says it's 100% plastic free, fully compostable or recyclable, vegan, made with FCA certified beech wood and natural palm fibers. Upgrade your kitchen habits by saying goodbye to landfill bound plastic dish scrubbers. So it'll make me feel so much better to throw these away. I mean, recycle them, but you know what I'm trying to say. Get rid of them. Um... Allow your brush to dry between uses. Don't let them soak in water. Signs of wear and age are completely normal. We choose to refuse plastic products because they last forever. We choose natural products because they don't. At the end of the brush's life cycle, utilize the replaceable head on the long-handled dish brush or pop off the metal trimmers into the recycling and compost the remainder of the brush at home. That's pretty cool. So I got that whole little set for washing my dishes along with some sponges and then i think that's it for like kind of like the reusable stuff so let's get go into other things so i grabbed this q-tip dispenser i just thought it was so cute definitely goes with my bathroom i have like a purple gray theme in there so i like that it's like a very sleek gray and white design with a bamboo lid and there is like a little hole at the top i'll show you so the q-tips just come out from that hole or you can just remove the cover but that is it right there so you're supposed to kind of just tip it and the q-tip comes out my boyfriend's like obsessed with q-tips he q-tips his ears like every other day so i thought this would just be a little more convenient for him and again this is a full circle brand so it's dishwasher safe it says the ceramic only not the bamboo cover safe for you non-toxic coating on the bamboo earth love friendly material ceramic and bamboo it's an intentional design the lid designed to dispense cotton swabs and access bigger items by opening no scratch base protects your countertops so i just thought this was really cute so i picked this up that was definitely like under 10 bucks it was cheap um let's see so i grabbed getting some into some random stuff i grabbed hydro grip primer by milk makeup with us wearing the masks all the time i've heard good things about this one they literally say it grips to your face so it helps your makeup hold on longer and not be rubbed off by the mask um so you get 1.52 fluid ounce i love the milk makeup brand i have tried like an eyeliner from them and other products so i figured why not try the primer especially because i've heard such good things and right now i really need something that grips to my skin with the masks it even says take your skin on a trip it says the shot of blue ag blue agave holds makeup all day for super fresh finish you guys can tell like the bluish green look to it and it says the aloe water the cherry blossom the hyaluronic acid and the b vitamins boost skin for your healthier looking base and it says it's it's universal goodness oil free silicone free green tinted formula goes on clear to walk, work across all skin tones and types and i love when it just has a pump so you just pump one or two onto your beauty blender your brush however you apply your makeup and just put it on so that is that okay so the next thing I got was a two pack of tongue cleaners. I had this on a, like a, I have like, a, I always have an Amazon buy list. Of course, I can't buy everything I want on Amazon. I would go broke. Um, you know, you watch like Amazon favorite videos and a tongue cleaner was on one of them. I saw, and you know, the girl said how it freshened up her breath and it just felt so good and satisfying. And I actually used to study dental assisting. Um, and you do have a lot of bacteria in her mouth. So I was like, 
meaning to buy it and then when i saw it popped up on the cause box market sale and it includes two and i do love my boyfriend so i thought that was really cool it is pure copper removes bacteria buildup like i said gets rid of bad breath and designed to last a lifetime so this is it right here they're they're like so pretty looking so you literally just hold it obviously you guys know you stick out your tongue and you literally just like kind of scrape it down so it says you can use it before after you brush your teeth and just rinse it before and after every use and obviously clean back of your tongue working your way down scrape center back and sides and rinse your mouth after cleaning and that's basically it so I grabbed that since that was on my list for a bit. Finally got that out of the way and said again on Amazon. I got it through Paul's box. Oh, so I did grab, I don't know if you would technically consider this a makeup product, but Pure Miracle Mist Hydrating Spray. I don't know if you need to say you can use after makeup. I know I think of it as more like a hydration spray. Like I use one right now. I have like a smaller version. I keep in my backpack at all times. Sometimes with a mask, I get really overheated, especially now with the weather warming up. We have like, you know, our, where we keep our water bottles at our desks away six feet away from the kids uh sometimes if you need like a mask break we can go to that corner put down our mask drink our water sometimes i will literally spray myself because i just feel get so overheated so and i love pure cosmetics so i figured why not try their hydrating spray so it says instantly hydrate dry tired and stressed skin but this one does say helps set makeup for long lasting perfection some hydrating sprays do so i guess technically it could be considered makeup as well so i like i can use this both ways uh, you know, you just mist onto face and body after showering throughout the day as needed. Apply after makeup application for extended wear. It says the citrus oils helps refresh the skin's appearance. And the folic acid nourishes with minerals and anemo acids. So, picked that up. Alright, and then the next thing I got was Silk Floss by Wowee. That's the same brand I got the tongue scrapers in um it, it's metal jar and it comes with three refills and it's biodegradable it's a mint candela wax and the box is made from recycled materials if you guys do, don't know what cause box is i mean it's i'm not gonna go to, into too much spiel but it's a lifestyle subscription box but they're very like environmental and they give back like that's why a lot of people love cause box so a lot of their products are like that so you get this cool just like little metal canister you get the floss and it literally has like a little stopper right there so just like a regular floss you know you pull it out and you rip but it's a cool little metal base instead of it being like you know plastic and i do think and it's not the wax is also better for you it says it's made from natural silk natural mint natural candina wax no parabens no preservatives no glutens no phthalates no artificial coloring or sweeteners and it even says this bag holding the refills because it comes with two refills to fill this again the bag is made from cellulose no cornstarch i'm lying so that is biodegradable as well so literally everything is recyclable and then you can reuse this even if i don't keep buying the refills this would actually be really cute to keep my pills like you know just to have a few advil ibuprofen if i'm getting a headache or cramps or whatever keep in my bag i could see multiple little uses for that so even i don't know does that fit a q-tip i don't know if a q-tip's too tall i can see my boyfriend carrying some q-tips around but i figured i would grab that um i also grabbed a toothpaste this again is like a more all natural toothpaste this is from g organics geo organics not sure how to say that it's a natural toothpaste it's mineral rich non-foaming formula with organic virgin coconut oil it's spearmint it's 60 milliliters it says made in britain and plastic free this is a glass jar um and it says it's free from synthetic ingredients it says this non-foaming formula is made with natural mineral powder such as calcium carbonate and kaolin this toothpaste is blended with spearmint leaf oil which has antiseptic and antibacterial properties so it's just a better for you toothpaste um you know you use a pea size amount, brush for two minutes, and rinse well. So there's zero waste here because it's glass, it's recyclable, better than plastic, recyclable box, 100% um, vegan, recyclable packaging, organic formula, cruelty free, gluten free, free from fluoride, glycerin, and SLLs. So, and Geo Organics is an English manufacturer of natural, eco friendly oral care products committed to the highest quality ingredients. So, I figured I would pick that up in the sale and try that out. 
Yeah, I thought so. So I ended up grabbing another Wow E. I got the Silk Floss Refill. So there's five refills in here. They are 33 yards each. Again, biodegradable. That same mint candela wax. Again, the box is made from recycled mint materials. The bag is from cornstarch. But basically, I get five refills. So I have like, this came with two on the side and there's one in the container. So altogether, I have eight. So this should last me a decent length of time. And I did cancel cause box, so I will not be able to reorder them. But like I said, I can always use that cute little canister, like for my pills or something. And then maybe I can just try to, if I really like it, I can order it a different way. I know um, I usually get the Coco Floss too from FabFitFun. I still have FabFitFun. Um, I mean, the, the material the, of the packaging is plastic. But the floss itself, it's made out of like coconut fiber. So it's like more natural and better. Um, but I just really like that concept and um so i wanted to get it but i have canceled cause box so the winter box was my last box but i was able to make a spring order because it was before i canceled so if you guys want to see what i got in my spring order i'll be filming that soon definitely keep an eye out for that um i grabbed green goo cold sore treatment i did have like a nasty cold sore um you guys saw the remnants of it like you never saw it like fully there but like once it came off and it was like fresh skin in a video because you could tell it was like bright red um and I was like, man, I wish I had cold sore treatment. So I was like, when I saw this pop up in the sale, I was like, I got to grab it. Uh, I might have already had this. It might have been sitting in the box in my room. Who knows? But whatever. Now I have it. It's made with lemon balm, caladula, St. John wort, and yarrow. And it just says, help temporarily relieve symptoms. It says it's a hemopathic salve. Um, it's 0.7 ounces. So let's see. It says... Powerful essential oils that help to re relieve the tingling, itching, blistering, and pain associated with cold sores and fever blisters. And it says, Green Goose Vision, hashtag spread goodness, is to empower change and redefine natural body care through time-honored traditions and personal plant-based ingredients. It does not contain petroleum, parabens, mineral oil, or any artificial ingredient, and it's gluten-free. So figured I would try that out. That's the only good thing with the mask is at least you can't really like see the cold sores that much anymore. And then I grabbed a bunch of Earth Hopwreck products. It is one of my favorite brands. Um, I never really saw them that much in FabFitFun. I saw everything in Timbuktu with Causebox. They literally had like so many different things. And I bought a few of them. But for the first time, they did show up in like FabFitFun recently. Um, so this is the Geostone Massaging Comb and Gua Sha. Made from 100% Jade. This is by Earth Harbor. They are like a skincare brand. But this is made... For your skin, if you guys don't know what gua sha is, you literally just like, you know, push it back. And it's really supposed to help with blood flow and the lymphatic system and wrinkles and all that. I definitely got to look more into this. One of my favorite YouTubers, Catherine McCarty, did a whole video on it. I have not watched it yet. And she posted that quite a while ago, maybe like three months ago. Because that is one when I watch it, I'm going to have to leave a notebook out and really take notes on it. But this one was really cool because it's a four-in-one design. So it says this gives luxurious head, scalp, face, and body massage. Um, so it says that as a head and scalp massager, it says use light circular motions with the jade comb. So this part right here to stimulate your scalp and promote relaxation. Focus on the areas near your ears and right above your neck to reduce tension. As a face gua sha, it says use the smooth gua sha side of your jade tool so i guess that would be this one um massage to the center of your face by a nose outward towards your cheeks i know yeah you're always supposed to go like outward um then proceed to massage down your chin and up your forehead so yeah you're always going like away um and then as a body gua sha use the smooth gua sha side of your tool massage anywhere on your body by scraping the skin with firm pressure to help reveal relieve tight muscles and it's ethically made in china um so i grabbed that while i was in the sale since it's something i've been wanting to try i do have like a jade roller but i wanted to try like gua sha specifically and then let's see from earth haba i also have this sunshine do antioxidant cleansing oil i have been wanting to i've been saying that in videos um do more of a two-step um cleanser i've been because they say doing a cleansing oil and then a regular cleanser is the best way to clean your face uh even to dive into glowing skin it's made with sea kelp and papaya 
enzymes. It's two fluid ounces. It's a really pretty eyedropper. This is something like I can see keeping out on my vanity. Hopefully the next apartment has a bigger bathroom. Maybe I'll finally start using this stuff. Uh, sweet tropical sunshine with silk and dew drops. Sail effortlessly across your face, removing impurities, pollution, and makeup while serenely exfoliating your skin. Antioxidant rich oils infused with sea kelp and papaya enzymes will arouse your senses while deeply cleansing and softening your complexion. She rinses clean with water, no tugging, scrubbing, or greasy feeling. Just a smooth oil massage and rinse, leaving skin fresh, soft, hydrated, and bright. I know especially with makeup, they really say you should do it twice. The oil helps, like, break down the makeup, and then the regular cleanser just helps, really like, get rid of all that other stuff on your face. So, I figured I would try to incorporate and do more of, like, a double cleanse. And then, I think the other three Earth Hopper products are all masks if i am right all right two of masks ones are moisturizers so these are the two masks i have the murina perfecting mask and that one has blue green algae and coconut cream and the other one is a refining enzyme mask red seaweed and fruit enzymes they were just such good prices and i freaking love earth harbor so let's go into the refining enzyme mask is red seaweed and fruit enzymes dive into glowing skin again and it says this one is powerful fast acting aha bha gel mask naturally resurfaces cools hydrates firm skin with the red seaweed oh it's like purple looking that's cool fruit enzymes white willow bark and aloe leaf juice to reveal greater clarity look of improved skin texture and tone and a more youthful glow all without irritating your skin you apply to clean skin leave on for three plus minutes and then rinse and it says use one to three times daily uh, i know some masks you can only use like on a weekly basis this one you can literally use on a daily basis um it looks like almost like jelly like i don't know if you guys can see that moving in there i love that purple color so figured i would grab that I have, like, a lot of texture to my skin, so that sounds amazing. And let's see. This one is the Marine Perfecting Mask with blue-green algae and coconut cream. These are both two ounces. It says, beautify and soften the skin with a wave of nourishment. Perfect to use for a natural glow up or whenever your skin needs extra TLC. It says, the blend of the clays and the coconut cream work to lovingly exfoliate dry and dead skin build up while the blue green algae and indigo provide luxurious skin nutrition blue cross gently removes your top layer of your skin to unveil newer fresher skin expect to have brighter smoother and more glowing skin immediately after use surfs up uh so i love these are more my preference the ones that are like a powder and you have to mix on the spot i just feel like they're very like potent i don't know if that's the right word but i feel like the second the water hits it, it's kind of when it activates it. So I feel like these do more for my skin. They last longer. I'm, I don't know if what I'm, it's just in my head, but that's how I feel. And you mix one to two teaspoons of this with a, and you, it says add water drop by drop until you have a nice paste is formed. Massage into the skin in circular motions. Let the mask sit cute. Cute, that's funny. For five to 10 minutes to work her magic and then remove with warm water. Follow with a cold cool water splash that's the, the warm water opens the pores cold water closes the pores keep in a dry place and this one is a weekly one which makes sense it's more like potent it's more it says it's more kind of like a scrub kind of because it literally says it helps remove the top layer of your skin so this one is a weekly one it says one to three times weekly where the other one said one to three times daily and then the moisturizer is a nutrient glow moisturizer with spirulina and matcha. Again, two ounces. So this is it right here. I figured it would be like a green color because of the matcha. And it says purely natural replenishing moisturizer that hydrates, plumps, and balances skin while giving you a mermaid glow. Mermaid's milk, lightweight, creamy formula is packed with concentrated superfoods, vegan hyaluronic acid, phytonutrients and antioxidants that perfectly moisturize soothe and nurture the skin wear under makeup or alone to let your skin breathe and you just apply it like any other moisturizer i know a lot of people got this in a box that i do not have um i'm not sure which one it was um i know it was one i do not have it was like either a boxy charm or a glossy box or the beauty box, whatever um and a lot of people that i watch unbox it loved it so that's one of the main reasons i wanted to scoop it up the next thing I have to show you guys is, but I never know how to pronounce that name. I have products from them. I've gotten them through FabFitFun, and I've always loved them. I have, like, a, a pillow mist. 
Um, and I have like a roller ball. This is the Balancing Calming Lotion. This one has chamomile. It helps align the body, mind, body, and spirit. It says yoga. Um, I think I even have like a yoga mat cleaner by them. They're definitely very like, I think, um, like, you know, very like meditation yoga that's what i think of and that's why it says you know literally help al align the mind body and spirit as chamomile which is known to like relax the body it says ultra shield lotion that delivers 24 hour time released hydrating emollients to dry damage skin it has a little pump i love the pump bottles and it makes sense because the creator of this company her name is danielle and then that name is her last name and it literally says she is a real life yoga instructor with a real life passion of making people feel and look and it's blocked off it has her like signature it blocked off the paragraph so i have no idea but she is a yoga teacher so it makes sense that it's those type of products um the next thing i got i'm pretty sure was in a bundle there was only really like one product i was like in love with and i loved it enough that i just was like whatever i'll grab the bundle so this is a detox facial mist it's 100% natural. You get 16 grams. It has spearmint and floral. I do have a facial steamer um, that when I was on quarantine, I was incorporating to my skincare. I haven't done it in a while. I need to do that. Like I was using almost every day. It would be every morning when I woke up. I would use it. Now it's probably going to end up being like a weekly thing. Maybe just on the weekend. It's just too hot. I start way too early from work. I wake up last minute every morning. I don't have time to eat breakfast here. I eat breakfast at the school. So there's no way I'm going to have time to incorporate like this huge skincare routine with a steamer. But I figured I could just throw some of these in my steamer and um, use it that way. So that obviously wasn't the product I really wanted. But I figured, ah, I'll use it. It comes with it. This is the other part. I was like, yeah, it comes with it. I'll use it. And like I said, in when I mentioned, showed you guys the pure hydrating mist, it is literally just a rose water hydra mist. Has rose aloe, chamomile, witch hazel, 100% naturally derived, 79% organic. It's four fluid ounces. I like that it came its own bag in case it leaked. But like I said, I do like to use hydration sprays. Uh, I'm sure I'll definitely be using them this summer. We do do a summer program at work. It's going to be very hot. People have been telling me to be prepared because they didn't have it last year. Last it was my first year working there and because of covid it was obviously canceled um so i could definitely see myself pulling out my mask and give myself a few sprays when i'm outside with the kids this is the item i really wanted it is by cosmetics that's literally what i want to call it but it's dx dix glow bamboo brightening mask i love bamboo products you guys know i've mentioned that on this channel before i literally have like you know, like the bamboo on top of my cotton dispenser that I just showed you guys. But I literally have like bamboo utensils. I have bamboo sheets on my bed, bamboo pillowcases. So I was like, ooh, bamboo and skincare. I want to try that. So it says that it is a brightening mask that helps remove dead surface cells for optimal absorption of brightening ingredients to help reduce the appearance of discoloration, uneven skin tone, and roughness for visibly smoother, brighter, and luminous looking skin. This is when you leave on for 10 to 15 minutes. Follow up with moisturizer serums. As one says, it can be used up to three times a week or as tolerated for your body. The bamboo is what helps exfoliate the skin. The niacinamide, which I've a lot of people have been mentioning niacinamide. It's in like that. It's like a new, I don't know if it's new, but it's definitely, I just feel like it's very on trend. I've been hearing a lot more lately in skincare, um, how good it is for your skin, but it improves the skin's elasticity, dramatically enhances the barrier function, helps erase the appearance of discoloration and revise skin's healthy tone and texture. And the last thing I can't even pronounce, tetra -hyl oh my God, look at how big that word is, um, Azorbate, a powerful derivative of vitamin C that provides antioxidant protection and helps to brighten the skin. Um, because this has a vitamin C, because I believe it's any product that has vitamin C, it does say, please wear a skin screen when using this product as it contains ingredients that may increase your skin sensitivity to sun, which I believe is the vitamin C. So you get 2.6 fluid ounces. So I really wanted to try that out. The bundle could have been too expensive. I don't see myself getting it. Everything altogether was kind of expensive. I was like, some, when I got here, I'm like, what was I thinking? Uh, but this was, I ordered this a while ago. Like I said, this was for the winter box. Was this before Christmas or after Christmas? No, I don't think we, we picked until after Christmas. I had an extra money, but you know, so I would kind of regret it. Cause I, like I said, I've been trying to save, but I haven't done a big purchase like this since. Um, I grabbed another milk makeup product. Like I said, I love milk makeup. This is a, it's another 
like cooling product it's called it's like cooling water kind of like the face mist but it's a different content this is like a roller bowl this one is specifically supposed to be really good for under the eye it's really supposed to help to depuff i use something similar to this now if i can reach it i should yes i dropped it of course from Tula Skincare that came in my Fab Fit Fun box, and I really like it. Um, and it makes my skin feel so tingly, it helps wake me up in the morning. But yeah, it's literally just this, and I literally just put it right under my eye. And this one I will even put over my eye, and I love the tingling sensation, I love the refreshing sensation. So when I saw Cause Box had it in milk make i was like oh let me try that one too and i believe this one has multiple uses because it's bigger i don't think it just has to be for under the eye it might have said it in the description when i bought it i don't think it says it here under the eyes to deep puff. Oh, right here. Apply to neck, face, and body just to cool and refresh in. infuse with natural sea water and caffeine so Basically, just like a little cooling stick. So I grabbed that, and it's from a brand I know and love. Let's see. I'm down, almost down to the end here, guys. I know there's been a lot. I grabbed an R&Co item. I love R&Co. They do really good hair care. This is the Acid Wash. It's apple cider vinegar cleansing rinse. Uh, this is really supposed to help with, like, the buildup of products. It's paraben solate, paraben-free, sulfate-free, petroleum, mineral oil-free, cruelty-free, gluten-free, vegan, UV protection. Um... It's yes, it's right. It's designed to cleanse without removing oils or color, help soften the skin, calm the scalp, add dramatic shine, regular looses, strengthen hair. It says squeeze on directly and massage the scalp, leaving for one to three minutes, rinse thoroughly. Can be used in place of a shampoo or a co-wash. And I've heard really good things about apple cider vinegar for the hair. I actually been using an apple cider vinegar hair mask by it's not R and Co. It's another really good hair care brand that shows up in Fab Fit Fun a lot. And it's not coming, the name isn't coming to me right now. But, and I have noticed really good difference with my hair. So I figured, let me like get this little rinse and incorporate it. That hair mask is like almost empty. I think like one or two more washes and it'll be done. It's only lasted me as long as it has because it was, um, what do you call it? Because I only do my hair mask like once a week. All right, so this product is kind of what showed up in the cause box as a choice for the spring. And I was like, I already have something like that. I don't need another one. But it's basically a collapsible cup. The one um, that you guys got to pick is a little bit different because um, it's a straw. It doesn't really go skinny. It's more like a coffee cup style one. But I will say, I don't know how well yours works. If you got to let me know because I have trouble doing it. Like, I can't really get it to fold. I think I paid like maybe $14 in the sale obviously it's valued at more but and I was able to get it to fold once I tried it when I first got it but it's a struggle like I there you go now I got it and then let me try popping it back out so it, it is easier to store um I like the concept especially like for my lunchbox for work and stuff like that or for a picnic but and then yeah you just pop it out but it does, it's not as easy as it seems but i don't know maybe that one because it's designed a little bit differently maybe it's better definitely let me know but i believe it's that same brand the stojo but this material too i will say everything sticks to it if you guys can see there's literally hair all over it's so gross i mean obviously i'm gonna wash this uh it has been you know in this bag sitting in my bedroom and i have a cat once it's in the kitchen that really shouldn't be happening but i will throw that out there to give you guys information on that all right, so I just have two more products here. So this is from Artisan Direct, and it is a geometric cutting board. The last two products came in a bundle set for, like, 50 bucks. I love, like, cutting boards. I'm, like, obsessed with them. I do charcuterie boards on them all the time. And I just thought this one was so beautiful. I love the staining on it. I love the shape of it. Literally just a geometric cutting board. It's just so different. So, and I love Artisan Direct. I've gotten other products from them before through Causebox. Our Lantern, if you guys picked that as your choice item, was from Artisan Direct. So I picked that, this. And then the last bundle item, the last item that came in that bundle, last item in general that I have to show you guys, it's basically just a little cutlery set. So I forgot what the name of the bundle was. They always have like cute little names. I think it was like Hostess with the Mostess. So it makes sense because like you're hosting. I love to host. I couldn't wait to move in here and have people over and then COVID hit and then no one wants to come. They're like, oh girl, you got too many stairs. The place is honestly really small. I wouldn't be able to entertain a lot of people. So I cannot wait to move and finally start entertaining. 
but it's basically a ladle and a spatula and the color is absolutely gorgeous and it is such high quality i have a ladle but it's like a plastic one i probably got it at a dollar tree so it'll definitely be nice when i have people i'll probably still i'm not gonna lie i'll probably still use a plastic one with just me and my man but like if i have people over how beautiful is this guys it's absolutely gorgeous and then it comes with i don't know what you guys would call it, a cake slicer a spatula whatever but so 50 bucks i got this and the cutting board now that i think about it, kind of pricey uh especially because i'm trying to save money I, I don't know when i had extra money i was just like oh you know christmas is over i've been bad for everybody else let me buy for me uh <laughs> but i've canceled claws box i have one more it's very small i think i spent the 50 bucks just to get the free shipping there was like specifically like two things i really wanted and then i think i picked up like a small third or fourth item just to hit the 50 bucks so if you guys want to see what i got in the spring and definitely consider subscribing hit the notification bell so you're notified when i upload if you like this video you like me you like hauls you like my beautiful cat behind me give the video a like it really helps the youtube algorithm definitely comment down below anything you guys want do you like the brands that show up in cause box you know like the r and co the earth harbor the full circle the green goo um is there do you guys do more like the skincare stuff do you do more like the everyday stuff like me like floss and toothpaste um or are you doing more like makeup um definitely let me know i'm always curious to see what you guys pick up in the sales but that is it for this video be safe guys